he would be ready to play. He would not be rushed. I think the mistake they made before was overusing him after the holdout, and I think that in, in some way had, a, had an effect on him being injured. This offense is not the same. Brooks has been banged up. Schrader stepped in as a number two receiver. They get Mays back, and I'll tell you what, the other thing, this guy Davis, converted wide receiver from Virginia, has been a big key to this offense. If they're going to compete with Minnesota down the road, especially in Minnesota, they have to get this offense rolling well, on all why, Sunday. Why Dorsey Levens today? I mean, they could play Dorsey Levens at quarterback and beat Philadelphia today. Why, why rush? I got an idea. Let's rest the whole league and get them ready for next week. <laughs> you you got to get ready for the, the playoffs playoff down picture. the road. Atlanta, right. the St. Louis. Is to Atlanta, St. Louis. We already talked about Chandler being out with the ankle injury, but Tony Graziani gets to start as opposed to Steve DeBerg. And why Tony Graziani? I have no idea. His last start last year went four for 18 with two interceptions for 24 yards, got benched at halftime. Steve DeBerg has already won one game for you in relief so far this season, had a bad outing against the Jets. Well, guess what? A lot of quarterbacks have had bad outings against this Jets defense this year. Just ask Steve McNair last week, got absolutely none. I would be with Steve DeBerg today, absolutely. Put me on a jet, let me run down to St. Louis. I won the game real quick before I be back for postgame, all right, with well, y'all? You're that good. <laughs> uh, hey, not that good, but I just think I can get it back for postgame. You know what this Atlanta defense? Take the rest of the day off, Just a man. second. I, got fly home after I have that. studied this Atlanta defense till I, it is, <laughs> <laughs> they remind me of a warthog. You know what a warthog is? A little bitty tiny thing got a touch hanging out its lips. And when you see it, got a touch. And when you see it, you just want to slap it because you don't fear it. It's a little bitty thing. But this is what they are. They're like warthogs. They will not, and they're vicious. You corner them, and they get after you. That's the Atlanta defense. They're not, when you know, you ever seen a warthog? Hey, Howie, in D.C., I don't think I've ever seen a warthog. A warthog. A little, well, that's this Atlanta defense. The only problem is we got to come up with some cheerleaders that goes with a warthog, how, and I don't know long, what that'd be. How long has this been? I've only been here a year. I was going, what's a warthog? I'm okay. telling you, everybody in here knows what a warthog is. We're just is. getting started oh, in today's show talking pig. about warthogs, so let's find Me. out what else is on tap. Coming up next on the one and only Fox NFL Sunday. They've got talent of the Gazoo, and they're the talk of the NFL. But can the Denver Broncos go undefeated for an entire season? Susie Colbert talks to the Mile High men who are getting close to making history. And they're two very different receivers. We'll talk with the athletic and loud jet. I got a hell of a reputation, Nola. As well as the overachieving and quiet jet. Then they said he's done. But now the only thing done for Dan Marino is all the he's done talk. Terry Bradshaw gives Dan the man directions to Canton, Ohio, as these QBs go one on one. Coming up. Coming at you, the one and only Fox NFL Sunday is brought to you by Gateway. Let's talk about your gateway by Pizza Hut, home of the stuffed crust pizza, the most fun you can have with a pizza by National Car Rental. So what are you waiting for? Let's go. And by Energizer Advanced Formula Batteries. No battery lasts longer. The votes are in and the nominees for Howie Long's Viewer's Choice Tough Guys are Randall, Davis, Emmett, Jamal, and Favre. That's right. You, the fan, picked these finalists, and now you, the fan, have one last chance to decide the NFL's toughest guy. Just go online to foxsports.com, cast your last.